everyone, welcome back to Spider-Man. I say I think things are going pretty well. I'm starting to get a little bit hungry though, so I think eventually there will be there's gonna be a nacho break in my future. I'm gonna eat some nachos. It's gonna be delicious. Oh boy! All right. Beautiful landing. All units, narcotic sale reported oh, in progress. Narcotics. Please proceed to Park City. All right. Well. We'll just handle the crime first, then we'll come back to that. Let's go get him! A very active crime scene. I'm losing him. I gotta catch up. Man, they really just got away. I'm losing him. Yeah, don't worry. We're gonna catch him. I think your shots need some work. Got it. Drugs are maybe my most disliked criminal activity. Definitely top five. Or bottom five. However, that works. All right. All right, let's try this again. I just want to do some science. This is a nice area. It, New York would be an interesting place to go to. I, I, just, I haven't traveled much to the States in my life. Uh, partly because, uh, in some ways, not everywhere, the Canada feels similar to the States. So I guess for me, they, there just isn't a lot of incentive. I'm not saying I can find reasons to go out, but I, the other thing, too, is like, I'm just not really motivated to travel much. For better or for worse. Kind of esoteric, but this station monitors the city's cell tower network and potential vulnerabilities. People will never think about it, but those cell phones that we all carry in our pockets create cell for a rogue agent to weaponize them if we're not careful. I mean, look at uh, the Dark Knight. They uh, definitely use cell phones to find the Joker. And, and like, I, I don't know the science behind cell phones. But I, I, I'm That seems believable to me, I guess is what I'm trying to say. Um... That's hey, unclear, but... This station's one of my pet projects. I always thought the cellular network was vulnerable to terrorist attacks, so I set this up to monitor it. Can you do me a favor? Look for anything suspicious. Uh-oh. It's not terrorists, but there's a glitch in the system that's causing interference. And if I don't fix it, it'll bring the whole network down. Right now, it's only affecting the most sensitive equipment, like mine. I need to stay outside the areas of interference while I fix the cell towers. I set my lenses All to right. show me the danger zones. Gotta fix the cell towers before the whole city's comms go down. The size of the problem area fluctuates. I need to be ready for a sudden change. Oof. This is a cool effect. I am really liking One down. Then I'll need to fix three more to solve the problem. Why is it? I can use way? those helicopters to swing. So much depends on cellular networks now. A crash would affect police, hospitals. It'd be as bad as a blackout. Gotta hurry. Soon the whole system's gonna go. Oh. I felt like my eardrums were gonna burst. And soon that'll happen to everyone. Let us 
Here's this. Got it. The job's only halfway done. Oh man. I wish there was a way to fix this for everyone oh, except people dear. who use their phones in movie theaters. Do that again. I'm actually gonna blow my focus so I don't end up dying. Got that one fixed. Bought me some time, but I can't slow down. Can't waste a second. Getting to be a tight squeeze. can share their domestic disputes on the subway again. And emergency services are safe, which is, you know, also important. If the network had crashed, it would have cost Oscorp a bundle to fix their comms. They'll want to keep this station up and running. Harry's project should be safe. Whew. Crisis averted. That would have been not good. And we're going back to daytime. That was a really cool effect. That was very unique and very creative. I have a lot of praise for that science lab. Which is cool, because I was like, I was used to them being like more or less the same, but then to have one like that, I was like, oh, that's pretty neat. There we go. Where is this? Nailed it. Wall Street. Oh. Neat. I didn't know Wall Street was here. Five marks five out of seven. Oh. Uh, let's go get this backpack and see if we can't get the, uh, the bridge as well. Perfect, there it is. Wait, forgot Real how much I love bridge. photography. Graphing calculator. I bought this used graphing calculator at a pawn shop. Stopped working in the middle of a trig exam. Eh, you get what you pay for. Hey, oh man, that brings back memories. Good old TI 83. What do we have for skills? Do we have skill points? Okay. Fist and baton yank. Hold triangle to yank small arms like pistols and buttons off people's hands. Oh, we can yank shields as well. Yeah, we definitely want to invest in this. Start yanking those things out of people's hands. Perfect. Okay, cool. So, this is going very well for us. Oh, we got this. Um, battery park. So, I guess what we'll do is we'll head for this backpack next. And we definitely need to hit the fisk area as well. So... Numerous witnesses saw Spider-Man swinging through Times Square like the glory hound he is, firing webs at electronic billboards and causing them to reboot. Granted, those billboards are an eyesore. In my day, sign painting was an art. But the more pressing question is, what was he up to? I have a theory. He is infecting these billboards with a virus so that they will subliminally hypnotize pedestrians. Hypnotize them into what? Into liking Spider-Man! And he's been doing it for years! This is the only plausible explanation for how many fans this menace seems to have! Boy, Jameson really has it in for us. Surely I can get... Oh. I saw it. Uh... 
Oh, is this it? No. Alright, I guess I'll just have to go a little bit closer. Hygiene kit. Superheroing doesn't leave much time for good hygiene. Gotta get it where I can. Yep, pretty standard stuff. Alright, cool. Guys, I'm actually gonna end the episode here, so thank you all for watching, and I'll see you guys.